What's up everyone and welcome back for more Legend of Zelda coming of time. In the last episode I got the poacher stall and I am at the other side of Gerudo Valley right now. And the cheese eating dude or whatever you call it. What the hell are you doing? From Kakariko is now here, so we're gonna give the saw to him. Hey, that saw, it's mine! But I thought I left that saw with my old lady. Oh, wait a minute. That Kokiri girl was his old lady? Gross. My big run tool broke, so I was going to Goron City to get it repaired. You're coming here is great timing. We'll give you my saw. Good kid, thanks. I'm sorry that I can't give you something as good in return, but take this anyway. And we get the broken Goron sword and we need to visit Bigoron to get it fixed. So it's off the Death Mountain, but before I'm gonna go and fast forward, I'm gonna show you this awesome jump. Which seems impossible considering the range and the normal jumps the opponent makes. But hey, it's Nintendo Logic. Never question Nintendo Logic, it is a bad mistake. Anyways, I'll see you once I reach um, Death Mountain because there are some things that have changed. So once I reach Death Mountain, I'll see you guys back in a moment. Alright, we're at Death Mountain Trail right now and this definitely didn't change, so I'll just kill those off. And there are large boulders on the road, but those boulders are a little bit more uh, threatening, as they will knock you over. Um, this hasn't changed, it's Death Mountain, oh uh, wait a minute, oh, it's not Death Mountain of course, it's the Nagos Cavern, it hasn't changed, and yeah, we're pretty much gonna go up to the top of Death Mountain. So, let's take a look, all the way up here, and wow, this circle of fire looks really cool by the way. Anyways, off to the top, let's see, is there still some sort of eruption-ish thing here? Yes it is. Hasn't changed. And they're still trying to get it. And he actually succeeded in me. Alright, so this part is a little bit tricky since we don't have the bow yet. I'm gonna take this one out. I am not able to reach the other one. But that is okay. Oh wow. As long as I get here first, then I can hit that one. I don't think I can reach it. Well, actually I can. That's cool. And now I can climb all the way to the top. Wow. We're getting so close to that fire circle. Anyways... Is there a way to figure out where Big Around is? Or do I actually need to clear the fire temple? Don't tell me, tell me I need to clear the fire temple first. But where is Big Around? I mean... Oh, wait a minute. Is that Big Around? Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa! Well, no word light. That Goron is huge! Damn! Anyways, but he seems like he's, his eyes are itchy. Well, anyway, let me, let's see this one. That broken knife is surely my work. I really want to repair it, but but because of yesterday's eruption, my eyes are irritated. I can imagine that the volcano erupted. He's like, oh my god, he w and he technically gets annihilated. There are fine eye drops in Zora's domain. You will find them if you go to see King Zora. Please go get the eye drops. All right. So we get the perception. Go see King Zora. Shut up. And poor Goron. I really need to help him out. So, um, I'll see you once I reach King Zora. So, see you in a moment. It's run him on. Oh, that hurt. All right. So I'm at King Zora now, and I'm gonna show him these. Oh, this is, well, hmm, <clears> hmm, <throat> eye drops. You might say we have them, you might say we don't. We do have the ingredients. If you take the ingredients to the doctor at the lake laboratory, he can make the drops for you. But you need to deliver them fresh. Can you make it before they spoil? And we got the eyeball frog, and we need to deliver it. 
Now, you might want to use your Serenade of Water here, but if I recall correctly, the frog will instantly spoil if you do so. So I'm not going to do it, I'm going to take the walk and I'll see you guys once I reach the prescription lab. See you in a moment. Alright, so I'm here at the Lakeside Laboratory and I'm going to talk to this dude and give him the frog. No, I'm not going to hold it up. I'm going to give him this. Oh wow, I haven't seen an eyeball frog like this since Sora Domain froze over. These eyeballs are so delicious. Tonight I'll cook fried eyeballs for the first time in a long time. Yeah, 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 yeah. Such great stuff. Please say thank you to King Sora. Uh, what? These are for making bigger on eye drops? Oh, how disappointing. Should have said so in the first place. So, he is gonna point out his finger. Or his thumb. Here it is. This medicine doesn't have any preservation in it, so it won't last long. Run as fast as you can to Death Mountain. You're young, you can do it. And we get world's finest eye drop, so we need to get into big room before they are not so fine anymore. And we got four whole minutes to reach the top. So I'll see you once I reach bigger run in a moment. Alright, so I'm at the top right now. And there's bigger on with his itching eyes. Poor little fella. And I'm gonna give him his eye drops. And he's like Really? You brought the eye drops? I'm so relieved. I'm going to use them right now. So he drops in one. And one in the other, I guess. Wow! This is stimulating. It's working great! Now I can get back to my blade business. My work's not very consistent. So I'll give this to you, so you won't forget. After a few days, please return. Wait. Just wait patiently. And he gives us the bigger on sword the claim check for it. You can wait for it to sort speak please. Now what I highly recommend you to do is to go in here. Then go back. I know it's hot. And you need to wait. So what I'm gonna do is fast forward for three whole days and I'll see you once I'm there. Alright, so I think three days have passed and I'm gonna check out bigger on and see if he's done. And he's like, oh, hey there fella. I'm gonna show him the claim check. That sword is my finest work. And here we got the bigger on sword, forged by a master slate and will never break. And this is our final sword, our level 3 sword actually, because Kokiri is level 1, master level 2 and bigger on level 3. It is a lot larger, as you can see. You need to wield it with two hands, but... And this looks really cool. As you can see, it... Oh, yeah, I know. But yeah, it is enormous, and it has double the power of the Master Sword, so that's really good. So, anyways, just for safety issues, I'm gonna cut it off. And in the next episode, I'll meet you guys at Garon City for some more... Yeah, cold side quest, we need to do it anyways, but for some more preparations before we enter the forest temple. So, thanks for watching, make sure to like, comment, sub, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace out, y'all.